Flyers TV is sponsored by the Bay Hotel. Big game, big game. Um, the fellows have been uh, playing good, good hockey and uh, you can see guys enjoying themselves and that's really when you get the best out of them. Um, they also know how important this uh, game on Saturday night is uh, for both teams. Um, we've been saying it for a number of weeks now that we're always saying the biggest game of the year, biggest game of the year, but uh, this time it probably truly is. Anybody um, looking at the conference now, whether it be Dundee, us, or Brayhead, they're all going to be saying these are must-win games, and they're all big games. So uh, we, we play each other a number of times, um, you know, certainly Brayhead and Dundee, and, and everybody crosses over. I mean, the permutations are, are too much to look into, and I've said a number of times what we're going to do is we're just going to worry about ourselves and try to keep our fate in our hands as long as possible, and that just means going out and winning your hockey games. Pressure is a funny thing, eh? I mean, it, it is what you make of it. Um, and uh, we fought ourselves right back into this conference uh, race, you know. Um, so I think that, um, you know, both teams are going to be feeling it. Um, and, and what we really have to do is focus on what we do best, go into this game, uh, and stick to the game plan, and, and come up with one of our best performances of the season. Um, I had mentioned... Uh, I think it was last week that, um, you know, we have a winning record against them in league play this year. Um, that's something that we'd like to continue on Saturday night. We played them home and away at the end of the season. Um, this is uh, our last game against them in the regular season. Um, there always seems to be fireworks and something on the line. So Saturday night, once again this year, um, it certainly won't seal anything either way. But, uh, you, you know, pushes a team another step closer. And we only have three Conference League games left. So we're going to want to um, try to get as maximum amount of points out of those we can. Um, but like I said, I'm not looking too far ahead. Uh, we're really just taking it one game at a time. And that's Saturday night in Brayhead. Jeff Lee's been training with us. He's up to full fitness. And um, this is uh, probably, well, the first time as, uh, as, as a coach that... Uh, I've had to make a decision about what imports are going in. Um, we'll, we'll make that decision as the week goes on, and um, you know it's it's good to know that we'll have a full uh, full roster going into this hockey game. It, it was tough on Jeff because he was he well he wasn't forced, but he was uh, he was a competitor and he fought through it and he played through that injury um, that um, when when we really needed him in the lineup. Um, with the addition of Nico, we were able to give him um, some some time off. Our medical staff and our physio staff were uh, were crying out for him to get some time off, and uh, sat down and talked to Jeff about it. And he thought that yes, he definitely needed some time off to heal. And uh, I'm glad that we could give him that. But it's nice to see him out there skating up at full fitness, and uh, he's going to have to get himself back into game shape. He's been out for oh, five to six weeks. Um, so, so that takes time as well, but um, it, it's nice to have that option and, and nice to have, uh, you know, another healthy import. We got ourselves a, a, what looks like a tough old run coming in. We're going to be playing a number of uh, teams that are vying for the league title. Um, we're, looks like we're in a dogfight for our conference title. All these games are going to be um, important to everybody to secure a playoff spot and, and league position. So um, we don't have as busy a month as January, which is nice. Uh, we do have one game weekends and a few midweek games that they're spread out, uh, allow us to prepare for it and allow guys to rest. Um, but they're, they're gonna be 10 games that are gonna be arguably the toughest of the season. Um, but the good thing is, is I think that we're playing some of our best hockey of the year or some of the most consistently best hockey of the year. And maybe this is a nice time to, to start the peak. Um, and, uh, and, and plus, the guys are playing a little bit of confidence. The crowd's behind them. Um, they're enjoying their hockey. And it uh, looks like it's going to be a fun run-in.